everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be showing you all of the bits and bobs I've kind of bought recently. So it's like a haul, mainly boots, some beauty bay, um, yeah a couple of different things that I've bought recently. I've kind of liked to treat myself, well I don't like to treat myself but I buy a lot of clothes and when I take my clothes back I generally spend that money on stuff that I like because technically it's gone from your account mm, I'm not very good at money saving so I don't know but um, if you are interested in seeing what I have purchased over the past couple of weeks then carry on watching and also I'm really excited to show you what I've bought because it's literally been sat on that bedside table underneath for weeks and I just want to use the stuff I just want to use the stuff so um, yeah carry on watching first things first um uh, in my previous primark video that you'll see you've seen um or you should see if you haven't seen it go and check it out i said that they didn't have any eyelashes and i really wanted to try them out so i went into guildford the other day and i was like i need some eyelashes i want to try some um primark lashes so i picked a couple up so i got the sosu deluxe lashes I don't know what they're called. Um, that look like this. So these were five pounds. They're really nice, and like wispy, and some long ones. Oh, threw them on the floor. Then I picked up some of the GWA Girls with Attitude to try them out because these are the slightly cheaper ones, and these are the more sort of like face Facebook famous. Um, Primark famous ones. So I wanted to try those. So they're Girls with Attitude. Oh, oh no, these ones are called Natural for gorgeous looking lashes. And then these ones are called Glamour for sexy, stunning lashes. So, interested to try them out. They don't come with glue, I don't believe. I don't know whether these ones do. No, I don't think they come with glue, which is fine. Um, but I'll give them a go and I'll let you know what they're like. I'm really interested in trying these ones because they look beautiful. Then, um... I'll do Beauty Bay. So, um, I picked up a couple of things from Beauty Bay because I was looking at more um, glowy festivals. This was before I was going to a festival, it was ages ago, when I was going to be going with my friend, and we were going to do like festival vibes. Um, so I bought like, glowy stuff, things for holiday. Um, so I'll go through that kind of stuff first. So, first thing I picked up was the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set spray now this honestly this is the one that i've been really excited to use but i feel like i can't use it until i did this video which is stupid because i can use it but this is the bottle how beautiful is that bottle honestly oh, stunning so um yeah this is just a setting spray but it's a it's glowy i've got that primark one so it'll be a really big test to see whether the primark one is better or worse this one will probably be better and i haven't actually had anything from anastasia but that's a lie i've got their console kits but in terms of like all of their other stuff i don't like use their brow stuff or anything so i really wanted to try out this so very excited to try that okay so this is something i have used because i just couldn't resist it it's called um dripping gold luxury tanning wonder water um and it's a self tanning face mist and it looks like water, as you can see. And this is by Sosu. Ooh. Okay, so this is by the brand that the lashes were from Primark. Um, but this is in the shade Medium Dark. And I cannot rave about this stuff enough. Literally, it says on the back... Um, Allow to dry before applying makeup or sleeping. Leave to develop for four to six hours or best results achieved when left on overnight. So I literally spray this on, once I've done my whole makeup, like taken off all my makeup, blah, 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 spray this on my face, wake up in the morning with a really natural, like um, seamless tan. You, I can't fault it. And when I wore it, everyone was like, are you, obviously you're wearing fake tan because this was before it started getting really sunny and hot. Um, I was like, yeah, like, you need to get this. It's so good. I don't think it was that expensive at all. I mean, it probably wasn't because I don't buy expensive stuff because living on a budget. But, yeah, this, unbelievable. Can't fault it. Really, really good. 
go and get some of this. I swear to you, you will not regret it. Then, oh yes, I decided to pick up um, a gradual tan. So a, like a, what are they called? Body moisturiser with granny gradual tanning milk you know it's like moisturizers that you put on every day because i really wanted to try those out to see if the, the tan would work better my skin's quite dry as well so it'd be slightly moisturizing so i picked up the bondi sands everyday gradual tanning milk now i haven't actually tried this yet i tried another one which i'll show you um but this one is also spf 15 so i thought perfect if you're you know going out for the day you put a bit on your legs it's moisturizer it's tan it's spf ding 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 you have a winner do you know what i mean um yeah i can't wait to try this out i'll see if it's uh patchy or not because i never really get on with moisturizing tans but i'd like to did i pick anything else up from there yes I did. So I picked up the LA Girl Pro Coverage High Definition Longwear Illuminating Foundation. This again is something that's been raved about and it's something that I've really wanted for ages. It's been my basket for ages, I just have never bought it. But it's not that expensive and I wanted to try it out on a video or something. So um, I picked it up in a slightly too dark shade, so it'll have to be when I'm really, really, really tanned, which is kind of annoying. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to try this out everybody raves and I want to rave with them. I then uh, just I'm stocking up on my Ofra highlighter. It's the mini one because I just find it it's £10 for a mini one I and like the big ones I don't know how much the big ones are and it's probably worth it buying a big one but I just can't I can't bring myself to spend that much money all in one go so um, I just bought myself another t um, another mini one in the shade Rodeo Drive which is my favourite highlighter in the world so then sort of festival vibes now i'm recently i'm happy i got these now because um i didn't go I, I ended up going to the festival but not with my friend and so i didn't go for the whole festival vibe but one of my friends is having a um festival themed party this year so i am so glad so i can actually put these to use um and i also want to do like a trial makeup get ready with me on this channel so i can try them out and see what they see what they like so um i'll show you the primark one again that i got so it was the face gem so this is the primark one that i showed in my primark video so this one's kind of silver and blue and it was two pounds fifty then i picked up this one because i wanted something a little bit more natural and not not i didn't want ones that were like do you know what i mean i just kind of wanted ones that was like oh cute like face gems um so yeah and, and stuff that doesn't distract from your makeup either because I want to be able to wear a nice makeup look and a little bit of a, a little bit of colour on there as well and in terms of colour like I don't go bold with colour so I went for quite plain colours uh, so this one is silver and then I've got a pretty similar one from the same um, company which is Festival Face um and this one is gold which this one's really beautiful because it's got glitter all around the all around the gems so that one's really really nice and then i picked up two from the gypsy shrine um so this one which is more kind of around the eyes as opposed to along the forehead which i just think is stunning um again this one's silver kind of a tinge of pink but not too much and then this last one as well, which is the, probably the most out there one, but I love it because I love these bits underneath the eyes. Um, so again, that's from the Gy Gypsy Shrine and it's it looks pink in the camera, but um, it's silver, that kind of like holographic, different colours and different lights. So love those and I'm really excited to try one of those out for a video and also for my friend's party. Boots I went to next and I have... Um, I decided that it was going to be the time that I'd use my points on my boots card because I have built them up for years and years and years and years. I literally never spend them and I thought, do you know what, I want to do, I want to get some other stuff, I want to try some other stuff. There's been, there's quite a few things that I've thought, oh, I really want to get that and they're not majorly expensive but they are just expensive for what they are so I thought I'm going to treat myself, I'm going to use my points that I haven't spent any money technically and I can you know I can use all this stuff so that's what I did used all my points so 
first two things I picked up were again tanning sprays so these are by um, the brand Isle of Paradise I've never heard of these before I was just going down the tanning aisles and they are um, again self tanning water so one's in medium and one's in dark um, because I didn't know which one I'd be and I didn't want to you know get dark and then too dark so you know I got both um, and I haven't used these yet but if they're anything like the face sprays then oh my goodness I'm in for a treat like it's so easy spray it on does it say it on here you literally spray it on you're good to go exfoliate moisturize dry areas hand and feet uh, covering hands and feet uh, oh so you just spray this on and then blend it with the tanning mitt easy as might be a little streaky but I reckon if I give it a couple of goes um, and it's also just not messy and dry so quickly and that's what I really hate about tanning is you've got to stand there like for like half an hour because you don't want to get like sticky you don't want to get your tan anywhere you don't want to get streaks all down you so um, yeah I'm excited to try these. And I went to the makeup brushes counter and because I'm doing this whole tanning thing and it's summer, I wanted to get a couple of brushes that I can use on my face for tan, but also for foundation. So I wanted to just try out a couple. So this one is the Real Technique um, Face Vintage Rostro, I believe it's called. It's the 202 um, and it's a, it's a nice big brush, like buffing brush. Um, it says Instapop Face. Oh no, and the rest is in a different language. <laughs> Why isn't it focusing? Hello? Why isn't it focusing? There we go. Um, so yeah, this one will be great for tan and also foundation. And then I've wanted these for so long and I've never plucked up the courage to get one. So I bought, what are they called? Blend and Blur. I just don't know what they're called but these ones that are like the brushes can you see I've wanted these for so long and I did I, I I think I bought a while ago one of the like cheaper ones just to see if it was worth getting the more expensive ones or not um but it didn't work all the hairs were falling out it was just it was pointless so I thought I'm using my points I might as well treat myself to one of these brushes and again you can use it for tan or I can use it for foundation. Final tanning things. I got the Derma Spa um, moisturizer, tinted moisturizer, because I used to use these and I rave about them. I used to rave about them and so many people raved about them and I was like, okay, I'm gonna try them again. Um, so I got one in the, um, with the soft, with soft shimmer and one just the normal one and I use, I have used this one quite a lot as you can tell um, and I've used this one slightly it's so hard not to get it streaky if anybody's got any tips or techniques or anything as to how to not get it streaky on your legs my arm my chest my legs like that's all fine but I can't it's so hard to not get it streaky on your legs so I've kind of like <laughs> stopped for now um the only good thing about it was it was a moisturizer in one as well but it's just the whole sinking in thing i'm just a bit like that like, takes too long so i will give these i will carry on giving these a go i will find a technique to make them not horrendous but i'm gonna need some time and these are on two for one which is what i picked up too Woo. i rarely get anything if it's not on a deal in boots <laughs> honestly i'm such a bargain hunter but i love it it's what you got to be haven't you face masks I love a face mask, absolutely love one, I've got drawers full, I love them, really really love them and I love having a big collection so one day I can be like, do you know what, I really fancy, fancy a rubber face mask or I really fancy a face mask that's going to be hydrating or I really fancy a detoxifying face mask, I couldn't get any of that out, I really struggled there. Um, so I picked up some which I've been staring at for ages, they're more they're more expensive than normal face masks. They're like three or four pounds of face masks, which personally I think is a bit ridiculous. But they were on offer again, um, and I was using my points. I was like, I'm gonna try them out, see if I like them, and then if I do like them, I can always get, you know, if you get one, one off for a special occasion or something, it's not too bad. It's just if you're stocking up your drawer with four pound face masks, absolutely not, can't justify it. So, um, let me... 
you can tell the offers by how many <laughs> I got. So these ones were on, I think you buy one get one free. Um, and these are the Divine Collection um, Gold 24 Karat Collagen Foil Tissue Patches for extra firmness under your eyes. Look at that. So this one's gold. Put it in front of my face so you can't see it. And it says, um, for tissue technology, firming patches for underneath your eyes. So I've got two of the gold ones to try those out. I love an under eye patch. And then I got two of the silver ones, which are for extra glowing. And uh, these are platinum and hyaluronic acid. So they're going to be really moisturizing for under your eyes. So I bought a couple of those as well. I think there's two, uh, it's just two units, but I don't understand what that means. Two glowing patches, oh there's just two in there, so one time use for each one. But I'm excited to try these, I've, uh, these actually one, these are the ones I'd never seen before, so I was really excited to try these. And then I picked up, how many did I pick up? Four, so these must have been on buy one get one free as well, or four for three or something or other. So these are the, um, what are they called? from Korea with love, so just Korean face masks um, that look like this. So I picked up four of the different types. So this one is balancing, um, it, it's a balancing sheet mask. So for oily skin, blemish prone and blotchy skin, so that's the green one. Then I picked up the hydrating one. So this is for dehydrated skin, rough and dry skin and fine, fine lines. Then I got a smoothing one, um, which is, oh, this one, this one's for your eyes. So it's an all intensive, all round, all round eye treatment for smooth, nourished and plump skin. And then final face one is a brightening one. So um, it says for dull, tired skin, dark spots and uneven skin tone. So depending on what kind of face mask I want, I can try those out. And Korean skincare is going to be amazing. It's like Korean, Japanese and somewhere else is going to be amazing. So I thought I'd definitely try those out. And then... My boy Garnier was on offer and I thought, you can't go wrong with a Garnier mask, can you? You really can't. So I picked up one of my favourite ones, which are these ones. These are the ones that you pop and then they go into the face mask at the top. So the orange ones and the blue, the blue ones I haven't ever tried, but the orange ones I love. So um, this one is uh, fresh tissue, replumps and smooth skin. Um, so I picked up one of these. These are three for two. Quite often these are on three for two, so keep your eye out. Um, and then a Garnier Moisture Bomb. So I love these face masks. The Moisture Bomb ones are so good. But I've never seen the um, lavender one. And so I thought, I don't really like the smell of lavender, but it does help me sleep. So I do have like a, um, a pillow spray that's lavender as well. So, you know, it's nice to it's nice to have something, you know, lavender. And then I listen to a little bit of meditation at night and you can get a good night's sleep. So I picked up a lavender one and this is a super hydrating skin. So I'm excited to try that one because again, the blue one, love it. And then this one, which I haven't seen before. So this is a pure charcoal black tissue mask, purifying and hydrating. So I thought I could try one of these out as well. Um, Garnier are my go-to face mask thing. <laughs> Whatever they call face mask brand. They're my go-to, I love them. So um, can't go wrong. Couple of things left. I'll do boring first. Kind of did all my exciting stuff at the beginning, which is annoying. I should have done it the other way around. So, topping up, a couple of mascaras, which I always use, which are the Lush Sensational Luscious with Oil Blend Full Fan Effect. A um, couple of these, three for two. What are you going to say? Um, and then I bought a couple of my concealers as well, because I'm running out of those. But this is the Fit Me in the shade Whoa, 03. So this is a fair one that is underneath my eyes. So I just picked up a couple of those as well. Again, buy one, get one free, or buy one, get one half price, or something like that. I don't know. Generally, if I've got two of like the same thing, they're going to be on offer. So then... This is the one, this is the reason why I went in there to treat myself. And then I just thought, oh, do you know what? I went over to the counter and I gave them my boots card and I just said, can you just tell me how much I've got on there? Um, because I didn't know whether I was going to have enough of this. And they told me and I was like, that's a lot more than I expected. I'm going to do a shopping trip, a shopping spree. So 
as you all know, Estee Lauder is my go-to foundation, but they have also brought out a um, water fresh makeup, which is essentially a BB cream. So I decided to pick up my normal double wear in the water fresh which is the bb cream for summer so it's slightly lighter um but it's still my go-to foundation um and i picked it up in the shot in the color 1w1 bone and it just looks like this so this is for um my natural skin color so my lightest skin shade that i usually am um so i can wear it and then get a tan and it's also got spf 30 in it so it's gonna be perfect for those days um where i just want to put a little bit of foundation on a bit of bronzer and i'm good to go um so it says water fresh makeup double wear what does it say water light super protective real skin finish 24 hour wear there you go love you absolutely love you and the final things were kind of a surprise to me so i've been looking for these for so long and i swear i've looked in boots i must have looked in boots but i dropped it but apparently i hadn't looked in boots and so i was going down all the lip care stuff i was thinking i need to get a new lip balm for summer especially you know when you go on holiday and your lips burn you've got no lip balm and you're forced to put sun cream on your lips and I hate that so i was looking for lip balm and i have never seen lana lips in boots ever i don't know where, whether i'm just going into small boots or they've just bought them out and i've been looking for them online and i don't know i don't know but they're just hiding from me i just didn't know where to get them from so i saw them and i was like i'm picking you all up so that if this is a one-time thing I've got them, so I picked them all up. So this one is um, Tinted Balm SPF 30. Ah, so I got a tinted one for if I still want the protection, but you're gonna need some color. Then this one is the Ointment um, Multi Balm, 101 uses. Little Tube of Magic, all natural lanolin balm with strawberry extracts and vitamin E. Uh, oh yeah, a multi-purpose super balm, use on super dry lips, skin patches, cuticles and more. So I thought I'll try out the little ointment. And then this one is just the lemonade lip treatment. So this one is more um, just your natural colour. Um, so this is probably the one that I'll reach you the most. And lemonade sounds nice. Sounds like it'll smell nice. Um, so yeah, I've just never, I don't know why I've never seen these. Have they only just come out in boots or what's what's the what's the hype? What's going on? So that is that is everything that I bought from Boots and Superdrug and Primark and Beauty Bay. <laughs> so quite a few places I've just stocked up on. Um, so if you enjoyed it, please give it a massive thumbs up. If there's anything you want to see me try, um, then head over to my Instagram because I'll probably be trying stuff on that. Um, and yeah, just send me any messages, any um, feedback, any, what's it, what's the word? Constructive criticism, that's all right. My mum told me to be less jokey and be more serious. So I'm taking that on board, mum, thank you so much. Um, and yeah. I'm just having so much fun with it at the moment. I'm really enjoying it. I'm going through peaks and troughs, not gonna lie. I go through filming and then editing and then I'm like, ah, I don't know what to do. It just stopped filming. Anyway, I was saying, it's hard to do things on my own um, and I don't want to be spending money every time. Um, and uh, yeah, I just want to be doing fun stuff that you guys want to see. So if there is anything that you want to see, anything that you're like, oh my God, I wish I had a YouTube channel so that I could do something talk to me and we'll do it like let's do it I, i've made an excuse for all of you to do all of those challenges that everybody secretly wants to do so um yeah send me a message comment down below give us a like turn your notification bell on so you're always aware of when i upload because it's very sporadic follow me on instagram if you haven't already and um i look forward to seeing you soon bye